Okay, good afternoon. This is going to be a YouTube practice regime number one with a special shout out to Estelle because she is the primary person this is, this is for. What we're going to do is do the whole thing with the click at 60, which you can probably hear in the background right now. There'll be more to add to this later, but for right now, this is just simply an open string exercise plus uh, four scales, which are all in positions that we've been working on, all with a click of 60. Once again, here we go. One, two, ready, open string. Take a few seconds, then we're going to do the D string open string exercise. Ready and go. And Let's take a couple seconds again. Now we're going to do the string crossing exercise and there's two patterns there. We'll take a brief pause and get going before the second pattern. The first one starts down bow. So here we go. Ready, go. Notice that I didn't go exactly with the click a couple times. It took me a little time to get it going. We should always be striving to go with the click. Now we're going to reverse this and start up bow. Here we go. Ready, go. might have noticed that I didn't get the open G to speak incredibly well on one of those. That's another goal. We should always be trying to get these as smooth as possible and also as clean as possible with the starts and stops of notes. That's going to be really helpful. All right, now we're going on to the F major scale. Here we go. One, two, ready, go. Now you may hear a little rustling in the background, that's my dog. 
he's trying to find a toy and he's panting a lot. So, um, you know, this is a real afternoon. <laughs> anyway, let's do that F major scale one more time. And. major scale a couple of times. Ready, go. Just realize that I have one edit that's wrong on my G major scale on that. Let's do that one more time. scale we did F major is all in half position and we just did G major that's in first position now we're going to go to C major that's going to be in first and second position here we go starting on the second finger ready go second position, this is the first one we've had to shift for, you can think of going from first position to second position by using that B, which is the leading tone, or the seventh scale degree in the C major scale, and instead of thinking four like you're in first position, go four to two. Put your second finger where your fourth finger would have been in first position to find second position. Those are your last two notes in the scale. So once again, the C major scale is Okay, here we go. Last scale and the last bit of this warm-up YouTube practice regime number one. This is going to be D major. D major goes from first position to third position. So it goes from the open D to the D an octave above that on the G string, which is a fifth above the open G. One, two, three, four, five. That's that D. Now on the D major scale, you've got a C sharp, so you're going to be two to four between C sharp and D on your shift. Let's give that a try. One, two, ready, go. practice regime number one and soon to follow will be something probably from one of your excerpts to play along with uh, that, that might be from one of your etude books and that might be some Mandel or that might be Suzuki depending on what we're working on at the current time. Hope this is helpful 
and I'll be seeing you in the next lesson. Thanks. Bye.